This has definitely helped all that build up in the back of Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And ooh, I am gonna try to get through this video today with him in it. all things golden retriever um toa is our first and only dog that we've had in this household and um i didn't have dogs growing up and i just thought i'd do a video of um the essentials that i feel like we we need for um for toa this can be an essentials for any dog if you didn't grow up with a pet or if you didn't you know live with one then it's trial and error for us so this is based off of our experience and i just want to show you a few things that are staple in this household and um so yeah the first thing that i want to woo, golden retrievers they have lots and lots of energy um he does get two walks a day um one in the morning and one in the evening Bibbit. A lot of these products that I want, I'm gonna go ahead and show you. This is our favorites for him, and um, definitely something that we keep repurchasing over and over again because we love. So the first things that I do want to mention, and I want to start off with his um, dental hygiene because, um, as you know, on some dogs when they smile or they have their mouth open, you can see plaque build up and if you don't keep up with that then um, it can lead to cavities and it can lead to mouth issues and we definitely don't want that for him so we have been um, we've tried a lot of products and these are the ones that we purchased um, several times so the first thing that I want to show you um, is the toothbrushes this item has been rated the best quality safe or safety quality comfort and um, so this is just basically a, a pet dental hygiene brush we have tried a few um a few toothbrushes and this is definitely our go-to joe loves this one because of the long stick and then it also has like the bigger brush and the smaller brush at the end um for hard to reach places but what i've noticed is that the back of his he wants to brush his teeth you guys oh toa i'm so sorry <laughs> you gotta wait for daddy okay you gotta wait for daddy um, but I, but what I've noticed in the back of his teeth, he does have um, a lot of buildup when it comes to um, like the plaque buildup. But this has definitely helped us tremendously when it comes to um, removing that plaque buildup. So his teeth are are really nice and shiny. So another item uh, for his teeth would be these pedigree dentist sticks. So we've tried a few, um, and, and we've always felt like this one had worked the most and he really loved it. Supposed to clean your teeth, freshen his breath. Um, yeah, this is clinically proven and I believe that because obviously we see what it's done to his teeth and it's really helped him a lot. So this here and, and it was so funny when this came in, I was like, what is this like a Colgate for, Colgate for dogs? It is formula here. It's a it's a dental fresh. Um, it's a water additive, and it looks like it's for it's safe for cats too. Do you like this? He love. Oh my gosh, he loves anything that anything that has to deal with his teeth, his like medicine. He loves medicine. It's hilarious, but it definitely has helped the build up in the back of his teeth, and we've seen a huge huge difference. Um, using this and he really likes it. So you put a little bit into the water bowl and it basically, you know, whitens teeth and, and freshens up bad breath and yeah. But this has definitely been our go-to. This is probably our second bottle. Most of these things um, we have purchased on Amazon. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and link the, um, the items down below. So if you guys are interested or wanting to try out any of these items, you can 
definitely find it in my description uh, box. So a lot of these are from Amazon and also um, Chewy.com. This teeth has been looking bomb. Me, I didn't think that dogs had to go through all these things and they can have all these diseases and um, mouth problems just as us humans. And um, it's very important to us to keep up with all of that because you know, we want to keep them living long and living healthy and that's number one for us. They say to not wash your dog every week, every other day. Um, I feel like when we did get him, um, we didn't really know. So we were taking him about every week and then it came to like every two weeks and then now we're kind of down to every month or so and we have tried lots and lots of products and of course um, the one that really stood out to us um, would be this one that he is currently on and it's called um, Fresh and Clean. We love this. The reason why we love this is because he smells good weeks after he has taken a shower with all the other products that we've used in the past. We don't see a difference like this. Um, a lot of product, a lot of the shampoos in the past we, that we've used, they, the smell doesn't um, last as long as this. So we've been really like loving this for him. And um, Joe ended up finding this one. We want Amazon. I'll link that. I'll link this below as well. I don't. I don't know why a lot of our stuff, a lot of the stuff that we do purchase for him, has golden retrievers on the front of it. And I don't know if like, I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why everything has golden retrievers on the front of it. But for now, this is what we use for him, and he loves his bath as well. So because we um, we wait a while for to take him a bath, we bathe him once a month. Sometimes we try to go a little bit longer, but he's such an active dog. He's outside running every day. Um, we ended up being gifted from one of our good friends, um, this waterless no rinse shampoo. And this is probably, I think this is our second or third bottle, but we love this stuff. Thank you so much, Jackie, for gifting us this product because it's definitely a must have for your pet. This is a waterless, no rinse shampoo. We love, love, love this scent. Um, we love that we can freshen him up after him running, <laughs> running for an hour at the park in the wet grass. Um, but yeah, this is definitely, definitely a staple to have in your home when you have a pet. This is pH balanced, paraben and alcohol free. Um, this wall brand, I've been recognizing them a lot, especially on um, social media. Um, but they've been so good, um, so good so far for us. We've also tried another product that, that we really didn't, we really didn't like. I prefer this over that, over that one. I and it, what it was was like a mitt, and it had like soap on the mitt already, and then you um, put a little bit of water on it, and then you'll. Um, rub it into his fur, uh, that's all right. But this one here, I really, really love because it's foamy. It, it comes out um, as a foam and then we usually just get a rag. We'll put it on the rag and then we'll just lather him up. I love that it's a, that it's a foam as well. But yeah, this is definitely um, one of our go-to. This is a lavender, lavender chamomile scent. Since we are on the subject of fur everywhere, since we are on the subject of cleaning, I do want to mention that we order these wipes from Amazon. We have them everywhere. We have them in the front, by the front door, we have them in the back door, we have them in our laundry room, anywhere that, oh, this is the camera. Anywhere that we clean him up after a day at the park, this is our go-to. If we bring them to my mom's house, we'll throw this in our bag as well so that he can, uh, so we keep him clean, especially our paws. His paws. So Joe and I are very particular about our floors. <laughs> this has definitely helped tremendous. Every single time he goes outside to use the bathroom, we use these 
right when he comes in because he's in the grass, he's in the mud. I mean, the grass could be wet. Who knows? We don't want to drag any of that inside of the house and have paw prints everywhere. So we definitely use these wipes and, and we'll use a rag right after if it's really wet, you know? And he knows the routine. He'll sit there, he'll put his paw up and he'll let, and, um, he'll let us wipe his feet. But this definitely, definitely a must for us. We never run out. We buy it in bulk on Amazon. And this is definitely my favorite brand. We've used several um, brands before and this is definitely my favorite because I feel like it's very soft. It smells good. It isn't rough on his paws. It's just definitely been a, um, a really good way to keep the house clean and the floors clean, of course, and then my carpet clean. Um, you can use this on his paw, on their paws, their coat, their face, their eyes, their teeth, their skin, anywhere that you need to clean your dog. And it has aloe vera in it, which is pretty cool. That kind of explains why it's so soft. And it comes in a hundred cal. But we, I think we buy a pack of eight, six or eight. So aside from that, I um, I want I want to mention that. Golden Retrievers are not hypoallergenic and they shed like crazy. And when I say shed like crazy, that means we gotta brush him. Brush him, brush him, brush him every single day. Sometimes I'll brush him twice a day so that I can reduce the amount of fur in this house. Let me tell you, if we, we literally, <laughs> he, he's getting excited because he loves to be brushed. Not right now, baby. Oh, I'm so shawly. Not right now, okay? We will when we go out. So, um, ah! I bought a brush where the bristles, you push the button and the bristles come out. He didn't really like that too much. He was more scared of it. But this here, he really loves. And I love that it's, it's shaped like a paddle brush, like a regular brush for, you know, human hair. But uh, I ended up getting this on Amazon as well. And I love this. I love uh, the comfortability of using it and how I can just brush him and be kind of rough with him and um, and he loves and he loves this and the only color that they had was pink so this is what we ended up getting no -uh, no 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 you guys our grass in the backyard is tore up like tore up <laughs> so um, in the beginning once we started to see spots because of his um, because of his pee. We were like, oh my gosh, what are we gonna do? We ended up finding these grass saver um, vitamins and they have been working out for us. Um, although we have to replace our backyard grass. This is still good just in case he wants to go <laughs> in our um, front yard grass, which we don't allow him to because let me tell you guys, when he pees, he pees like a human. When he pees, he pees like a human. And it's so much pee that it literally leaves like a big old round spot in your, in your gra on your lawn. And I would hate for him to accidentally like pee on the neighbor's yard, on the, the neighbor's lawn and leave like a big old brown spot. Um, I don't know if it like fries the grass or whatever it does. I, I want to start preventing it. Not only for our front lawn, but our neighbor's front lawn, and of course the park's front lawn. But currently, right now, our grass is pretty jacked up where he usually goes in the in the backyard, and we definitely want to replace it. I am thinking about maybe even um, getting um, false grass, but I'm not sure. I, I need to do more research when it comes to when it comes to that. But another thing, and I'm sure all of you pet owners have, would be this. It's definitely an essential to have um, the waste bags for your pet. And I like that, um, you know, we just take it anywhere and it comes with the extra, the extra bags. And we can actually use this canister um, for any other rolls that we, that we buy. But this is definitely a must have when you have dogs because you do not want to leave their poop at the park, especially the size of this guy here, 82 pounds. We don't wanna leave <laughs> poop that looks like human poop at the park. Please pick up your dog poop. 
please, okay? So aside from all of those products, the last two products that I wanna show you is absolutely a must have for our household. I do wanna show you our Dyson. This is our Dyson V11 Animal Plus. So I love this product and having a golden retriever and hard, dark hardwood floors, we are always, we always have fur everywhere. And if we don't vacuum four times a day, and I'm not even kidding you, we all rotate and we make sure that we vacuum in the morning, at night, twice during the day. It is ridiculous. And then we and then we mop once, um, once every night. So this has definitely helped us out tremendously because it is cordless and um, it's easy for us to just grab and to hurry up and just vacuum the hardwood floor everywhere. And then of course, our little carpet area that we have, and then we have a little carpet area under the um, the table. But it definitely saves our floors because we are floor people. We don't even wear our shoes in the house, but this has definitely helped us keep our floor, floors clean and fur free. We use this four times a day, and then the days that I'm really like I'm I'm over I'm over vacuuming. This is what we use. So another item that um, is a must have that helps me assist with all the fur on the floor would be our little shark um, vacuum here. And I love this because if I have family over and I'm serious, like we will, I see fur floating in the air right now. <laughs> We'll have family over and toe will be everywhere. And instead of me pulling out our Dyson vacuum, I'll just have this running. And it's definitely helpful because in an hour, this floor can be covered with fur and it's pretty bad. So um, it's definitely, <laughs> it's definitely, definitely a lot of work to have a golden retriever, especially um, because they shed so much. But then this has definitely been a helper. Um, you know, even on the days where I'm like, I don't even want to lift a finger coming coming home from work, I will turn this on and it will help. So it's down here, <laughs> causing a ruckus. It will help me, um, you know, keep our floors clean and and fur free. Like I said, this is definitely a must have for us. We have one in every single car. We have one in every single bathroom. We have one in the laundry room so that right before we go out the door, we check ourselves roll our pants, whatever we gotta do. This is definitely a, a must if you have a pet that sheds a lot, just like Toa here. And you can see all this fur. But literally all day, I feel like I've relied on this so much because I don't wanna go anywhere and I don't wanna be like, you know, have pet hair all over my clothes. Um, but yeah, especially at work. I have one at work and I'm just like, right when I get into work, I'm rolling myself and my coworkers know. Um, so this is definitely a must have. Had saved a lot of our uh, clothes and the appearance of, you know, fur everywhere. Love this, I use it on our couch. I'll use it on, um, I even offer, when people come over, I'm like, here, you wanna, uh, if you're wearing black, just to fair warn you, you're gonna be covered in fur. But that's the joy of having um, a pet. And you know, we love Toa so much. He is definitely worth all this work. <laughs> he has kept us on our, our toes with the cleaning um, situation. And yeah, ah, uh -uh! no, <sighs> you guys, <laughs> this is him. All right, you know what? I gotta end this video because he's way too excited. I'm probably gonna go outside and brush him right now because he really loves it. So I just wanna say thank you guys so much for watching this video today. And I, I hope you guys find it helpful. And again, I will link everything in the description box below if you guys are interested in any of these items. I highly recommend any of these items. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And until next time, we will see you guys soon. Bye! Ah, ah. Say bye, Noah! Kiss your boy!